so strange and so outlandish and uh, reminded everyone of a drug trip, which a lot of this film does. Yeah, pretty much. I don't want to take any assumptions, but I'm pretty sure Kirby must have done something in his youth to come up with all these art styles and all this artwork that he does. It is unbelievable, really. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't know. He's got some on the air research. It is. Um, You know that uh, he was drawn by Ditko, not Kirby. Oh, Ditko. Well, (laughs) well, you know... Potato. <laughs> well, not at all, because Ditko was very, very right wing, very well, straight laced. Fine. Probably would never touch drugs in a million years and became a massive shut in recluse in his later years. So, yeah, he, he, he was a big fan of Ayn Rand and things like that. So, I don't think he did, which is the bizarre thing is that his art style was so, so out there, but he as a person was so straight laced. <laughs> it was really juxtaposition of these two things. 